another one. A brilliant, brilliant performance tonight. I thought it was mature. Um, he showed tremendous um, maturity in the ring. And Martin has done a fabulous job and he deserves a real accolade. It's a team effort and they've done well for Martin, you know, as much as Daniel deserves it and Tony's managed as well, you know, they need better people to work with and uh, I just felt tonight it's a little bit of a coming of age. I've always had the confidence in Daniel's ability, at 21 years of age, being put into a, into a, a fight like that, high pressure fight against another undefeated young, young uh, gladiator. He, he did everything he had to do. He, he, he got tremendous job. Got caught a couple of times. With good shots, so he ticked another box. Not in getting caught, but he took the shots. We don't seem to take any more of them. But he's, but he's, you know, he gets you in trouble. You've got a problem. He gets you in trouble. He does get you in trouble because he does what good fighters do. Good fighters can jack. Good fighters can jack. You know, the best heavyweight, one of the best heavyweights I see right now is Larry Holmes. He's like a young Larry Lund with that jab he's got, and certainly with a power. And he's done fantastic tonight. Anyway, I'm sure you've got questions to ask, so leave you guys to it. Daniel, how important was it to win in the style you did tonight? I mean, that was a phenomenal performance. How important was that to you? Yeah, it was. Uh, I come out uh, straight away to throw on and be sharp and uh, go for the kill. But, uh, I had to just adjust and box and be clever and um, after I come, come back to the corner, listen to the corner and just calm down a bit. I just put my stuff, put my work together and the knockout came. Did, did, before the fight, did you feel any nerves or yeah, anything? Yeah, uh, strange, it was different this time. Uh, I didn't feel um, as, as fired up as I usually do, sort of slow, slow build and I don't know if it was... Um, you know, it's just every fight's different, so I take it as it comes. And right now, I'm just I'm, I'm glad I won. And who's next now? Did he? Did he? He caught you with a few shots. Did yeah. he really hurt you at all? No, no. I was totally tunnel vision. Whatever he hit me with, I didn't phase me at all. I came, came for it and was solely uh, focused and one mind in, in my assault and just to come out victorious. So I wasn't going to let anything get me. Don't get any call to that, does it? That's, that's a real you know, professional approach and maturity. It's amazing. Daniel, as you were walking into the room, you were sort of joking, saying, Who's next? Who's next? Well, who, who do you want next? Uh, I leave it up to you know, Frank and my team, Martin and my dad and everyone else to sit down at the table and figure out what's the next move. Uh, bridge title is a big belt, so you can defend that a couple of times or I'll move on to what you know, challenging world on with um, climbing up the ranks and getting world ratings and all the things. Yeah, it's September. That's what we're looking at. Then given the animosity between you and Nathan, um, how hard is it to keep it in Goldberg and not get involved in it here? Um, you're 21, but you kept your discipline. How, how, how hard is it to listen to your corner and not get involved in it? Well, uh, I just do what I've been training to do and I sort of blank out the emotions as best I can and get on with the job. I didn't want to let anything hold me back. So, so false pressure, stopping, getting out of my way. So I just keep my mind focused and I just dealt with what was at hand. I, I wasn't going to away with anything yesterday. Daniel, how much does it mean to you to have won the title and then to have the title again? Expecting sort of thing, things to change after this fight in terms of fame and the kind of attention yeah. you're going to get, and are there going to be new things you need to deal with? He's only going to get on the front page and write some notes. <laughs> <laughs> step up, I'll step yeah. up. Now it's time for you guys to step up. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, uh, it's just another step. Right? So I just keep, it, keep in the gym and keep focused. I've got good people around me, so. I won't be um, at all sidetracked, I know I've still got a long way to go and a lot of improvement to do. Any other questions? Or can we let the young man go and get his shot? <laughs> <laughs> all good? Yeah, thank you very much.
Thank <laughs> you.